What's up, y'all? Yes, that's right. I'm back in the kitchen, chefing up my healthy, sweet and sour chicken salad. So, first of all, it is healthy. So we're gonna start off with some fat-free Greek yogurt. We got some low-fat cottage cheese. We're gonna be throwing in them celery diced up apples. Now that's that sweet and sour value. I did the red and the green apple on the chopped mix. And we got those sun-dried cranberries. Then we also have those amazing onions. We got pecans. And we also have the John mustard and our chicken, right? Seasoned up with some ground pepper. And I sprinkled in a little bit of salt, just a tad bit, not too much, just a little bit of salt as well. And you know, add some fun to it. If you have other spices that you like to include, you can always add that in the mix. All right, now once you have this mix, we're gonna grab that, yes, golden bowl. All right, so before you even start getting to the chicken side of everything, you wanna get your uh, sides in first. So basically, you're gonna drop in that nice yogurt. Got the cottage cheese here. Boom, drop that into as well. Then we got our celery, throw that in the mix. Our sweet and sour sauce, right? With the apples, red being the sweet, green being that sour. Throw that in the mix. And you have your nice cranberries right here. Throw that in the mix too as well. Your onions, boom. And then I'm gonna go ahead and throw in my pecan, all right? Pecans in there, boom. And then last but not least, that Dijon mustard is gonna go in there too as well. We got a nice little symphony here in this bowl. All right, nice little healthy symphony. Before we add that chicken in, we're gonna go ahead and stir it up. Stir it up nicely, mix it in nicely, mix it in nicely. Super simple, guys, stir it up. You see everything blended nicely. You want that nice blend at the end. And once you get that blend going, and you don't see anything sticking out, extra, you want everything to be mixed in and blended up really well. We can then add our chicken to the mix. Now when we add that chicken is when you can get saucy with it. If you like to add other sauces, you can. For me, I'm keeping it pretty plain. Ground black pepper, a little bit of salt, um, and I threw, throw some lime on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw some lime on top of that. All right. I'll squeeze that in the mix. Lime always adds a little flavor. Let's go ahead and throw that lime in there as well. Oh yeah, this is gonna be delicious. I can already taste it. Good, so now that the lime's on there, I'm gonna go ahead and dump that into the bowl as well. So everything's mixed up nicely. Dump it into the bowl. And then once again, start that mixing process up. That mixing process up. And like I said, make sure it gets all in there, blends in well. Now this serving that I made is for about four people. Stir it up, stir it up, stir it up. Three, two, and one, and ding, 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 ding. I believe our salad is done. Let's go ahead and put it on that plate. Cause I'm a little bit hungry. Put that down right there. All right, I'm gonna give myself a nice little portion. All right guys, let's see how this thing tastes. Oh my gosh. That's delicious. That's really delicious. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna give me some more of that.